Backstage at the 59th annual Grammys, I love, this is my fifth consecutive year covering the Grammys. I'm Ralphie, by the way, and I love coming here because of stories like this. Last year we were here and a song was released called Don't Let Me Down by the Chainsmokers featuring the woman I'm standing next to, Dea. And Dea told me the whole story about how she auditioned for it and the Chainsmokers coach. Co that's basically what you said. Kind of. And the Chainsmokers like coached you through it and then they selected you and then it became the song played the most on pop radio throughout the summer and for the entire year. And now it's up for best dance record. Now we get to say the Grammy nominated Dea is here. Ooh. How you feeling? Uh, pretty wild, pretty crazy. Uh, nervous for Sunday. Okay. Um, do you have the whole ticket situation handled and everything, or no? The ticket situation. Like, do you know who, like, who's coming? I'm bringing my fam. I gotta bring my fam. My mom is here already, and my sisters are coming later this week. Awesome. Oh, sister. Yeah. I didn't know you had multiple sisters. Yeah, uh, you I, met I, the I one. You I met, met my Rachel. older sister. Yeah, right, yeah. Okay. And I have three other sisters. Oh, she's your little sister? No, no, no. Rachel? She's my older, older sister. sister. I was gonna say, yeah, right? Okay. Yeah. And you have I have three more, so I have four sisters total. You're one of four. One of five. You're one of five. So you have do a brother as well. Do the math. One plus four. Yeah. Oh. No, I don't have any. I don't have any brothers. <laughs> you know what? Look, I know we go back. Doesn't mean you need to sass me, miss, okay? I'm sorry. It's I'm all right. No, you're fine. You're all good. You're all good. You're Grammy nominated now. This is your week. This is your weekend. What has yeah. this whole experience been like for you? Uh, it's, I mean, it's crazy. It's so, so much fun. And I just love, you know, putting out music that people can relate to and love. And I hope to continue doing that. And, uh,. Yeah, let's hope let's hope for the best on Sunday. Of course, best dance recording. Now wait a minute, did they move that award to the main show, or is that still a part of the pre-show? It's they... part of the pre-show. Okay, so you got to go Boo. to Microsoft Theater, I believe, right? Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. so I, so which is still great, but right. yeah, well, it's, it's webcast though, at least. Yeah. So people can can go online can see and, it, yeah. and yeah. check it out. Alex yeah. and Drew are gonna be there as well. Yeah. Okay, mm -hmm. great. So it's a long day for you guys. Yeah, it's gonna be fun. I mean, it's the Grammys. I'm I'm willing to get up early for the Grammys. When we sat like pretty much in this exact spot a year ago and you told me about Don't Let Me Down, did you ever think a year later you'd be back here nominated? I don't think so. I mean, I, I knew it was a great song, but you can never tell how it's going to hit with radio and with fans and everyone, but everyone embraced it from the start, so I'm super grateful for that. Catching up with Daya here on Ralphie tonight. We're backstage at the Grammys. So the last time we chatted, uh, I think you had just dropped or were about to drop Sit Still, Look Pretty, the album. Yes. And now we have another single, Words. Why did you choose Words as the next single from this? I chose Words because I felt like it was the best direction for me musically. I felt like I was kind of going more into the electro pop lane and uh, and a lot of my other songs were like straight up pop and I kind of wanted to bring in the electronic elements. It has a really super dancey production in the, in the hook so I really loved it and uh, it was just kind of that simple. I just went with my gut and hopefully people like it too. 